Yo, bandits. That's right. It's legend over here. Now, quick end to the point why this video is here. Many of you know that I went to play and make content for Lost Ark, and it has been a blast for the past half a year. However, recently I took a break from YouTube because I get pretty busy in real life, and on my free time I focus more on streaming. Now my schedule cleared up and I am ready to get back to making videos for Lost Ark. And here's where you will have a logical question. Why is there a Vindictus video? To be quite honest, <laughs> I'm not really sure. But throughout these six months, I have received hundreds and hundreds of messages from people regarding Vindictus videos. And I thought to myself, maybe, maybe, I can mix up the content for both Lost Ark and Vindictus and see how it goes. Now, I'll try to shorten the length of the videos, just like I did and will do for Lost Ark videos, so you guys won't fall asleep during them. However, the timestamps will always be in place so you will never get lost. As for the conclusion of this intro, I'm still quite pissed off with the management of this game, and I do believe that it doesn't deserve any sort of advertisement until the staff of this game regain any sort of competence and learn to communicate better and listen to already small player bases feedback. But at the end of the day, these videos are made for you, my friends, no matter how much I dislike the developers and whatnot. So let's just say... I'm back. Man, this feels a bit weird. I haven't done that in ages. But here we go. Version 2.91. New hero Ladia joins the already large roster of Vindictus. Uh, here is the uh, quick introduction of the character with few ability showcases and story. TLDR, we made a female Kale with Donna's face to sell more all curves outfits and called it a day. Seal of Bravery Shop Revamp. This is kind of a big deal. The Astera support items in the Seal Shop are now replaced with Militia to further help new players advance in the gearing. Old level 95 accessory essences removed and replaced with level 100 essences. Though I'm not sure why, given the fact that you get these from the free gear box anyway. But whatever. The cost of Damascus and Jardin steels uh, have been reduced, which is quite convenient, once again, for new or returning players. Misc changes entail many many fixes and description adjustments, didn't notice anything huge there, but if you like to dwell deeper into the patch notes, you can check it yourselves on the website. Moving on to sales, new loot box slash gacha added for this month, Cherish Crystal. The gacha contains the Techno slash Cybercat outfit, to be quite honest, it's not a bad set, but maybe mostly because it has stockings and that's my gem. <sighs> Cyber Hunter set for males looks pretty nice. Romal set, which is the replica of the big boss. Time to do the cosplays, people. Laura set and Laura wings to match the last redeemer. Two shower stall objects that uh, make their return once again to restore fatigue and be naked in channel one. That's what we all do, right? Business fears and savage sets for some classy lewdness and tropical beach and vacation outfits if you're a Melina enjoyer. All the outfits that have Destiny box in the description means that you can choose between a normal version and a huge tit, I mean, all curves version. Overall, quite a large gacha to celebrate New Hero, so I wish you good luck if you will be rolling these. Next up is Savage Package Sales. Classic comrade sale with a new twist. You either purchase packages for enhancing style, AP, or dice that contains either runes or dyes or regular outfit, whatever you need, uh, and one comrade coupon. Gather four coupons and exchange them for the comrade box in which you can choose one of the following comrades. Succubus, Arcana, Nemain, Claire, and Regina. Or just buy a special package for $100 that will contain a comrade box inside. 
Overall, the latter is a good deal if you don't have a comrade at all. Other than that, I would rather skip that sale and save yourself the money. Ladia Avatar Shop Update. Nothing special here, just a list of uh, available inners and hairs for Ladia, and also her two exclusive hairstyles added along with her exclusive makeups. Moving on. New hairs added, the ponytail for females that I've heard has good physics and looks quite fairy and nice. And a bun for males if you want to look kind of like Anakin Skywalker when he was a Padawan. Lastly, the events. Take it to the max event, classic event for leveling up. Every milestone, level 10 or 20, etc., you will obtain extra rewards once you pick up the quest. You get even more rewards on top of the existing ones if you will be using this event as Ladia. So, an event to pretty much support Ladia, but still good if you plan to level another character. Join the Discord event. <sighs> the more people will join Discord, the more chance that staff will release a coupon that you can redeem to gain 30 GM coins to spend in the in-game shop. Just, get, just keep an eye on Discord notifications of Vindy server and you will be golden. Gathering Dungeon event once again an old event where you grab a ticket daily and use to go into uh, a special dungeon to gather essences from the trees. Then you can exchange these essences for fusible armor pieces or outfit pieces at Shayla in Colhan. Damascus Seal event, an upgraded version of Damascus Steel event. This time, instead of getting the steel itself, you will get a seal to exchange in the shop. So if you don't need the event steel, you can instead purchase some fruit juice and other stuff. But I, I like the idea, but wish there were better options. Like, for example, I don't know, exquisite HP pots for, you know, it would make more sense, really. And lastly, the golden and hot time events. Hot time is pretty straightforward. Every weekend we get double AP, double XP, double expertise and speed, and both Evil Core plus one. And the golden time uh, is as classic as usual. Log in to get a guide and complete missions to receive coupons. Trade the coupons for a large variety of items and also a bonus golden time coin. These coins can further be exchanged in the shop for even more items to help you in the journey. Keep playing and doing any content in the game to earn the coupons and the coins. Good luck. And that's it for today's patch. Hope you guys find Ladia fun to play and enjoy all the events. Let me know in the comments below. Maybe there are some videos you would want to see, even though I still have some unfinished ones that I might complete in the near future. And it's really good to see you all again. Love you all 3000. Be safe. And I'll see you soon.